you guys are looking for the cheapest coins on the internet right now, make sure to check out my brand new sponsor, MMO EXP. They have the cheapest coins that you can find anywhere on the internet. Use code Poodle at checkout for 5% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to be going over kind of the issues that are being addressed and some of the Madden 21 potential news we have going on here. So, if you guys haven't heard the past few months, there's been a big debate slash turmoil over Madden card art. There's been some curiosity regarding Muttmaster and the direction of them, as well as some debate on whether or not we're getting Madden 21 news, Mutt related, way too late. Because as you guys do know, it appears we're getting the news on Matt on Ultimate Team two days before the game release. But also, guys, shout out to the director, awesome guy in the Madden community, makes awesome content, of course, great at directing, and he makes super cool card art. So I probably will be using one of these card arts for the thumbnail. Shout him out for that, guys. Make sure to check out his Twitter. I will leave his link down to his YouTube down below in the description. Go drop him a sub. Super cool guy. Going to be, of course, recording during the Madden 21 season, so make sure to check him out. And yeah, guys, that's about it. Let's get into the video. Jake Stein, one of the developers for EA, did, or Madden Mutt, I should say, did come out and give us some hints today, um, make some rep comments, and did kind of give us some insight on some things. Now, by insight, I mean if you're good at riddles, it might be some good insight. If not, you have to wait like the rest of us, but I will be going. I will read the tweets to you guys. I will kind of go over what kind of happened today in the muck community in the morning. But starting with the card art debate, guys. But before we get into the video, make sure to go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell, boys, come join the family. Give this video a big thumbs up as always. And if you guys haven't already, smash the like button, guys. It helps out a lot, especially come join the family as we're getting close to the year with the new mud season. Moving on. So as you see here, complete the missions, earn your nat 99 overall rookie. Now this is Joe Burrow, Madden 20. And they said to earn your Madden 21 quarterback Joe Burrow. So this is what started the hashtag fix Madden franchise on Twitter. Now guys, the t this tweet specifically didn't go viral and go like and start trending, but it did pretty much trend within the Madden community. So it didn't trend overall on the page, but Madden community more or less knew and Jake Stein pretty much said today that he realized and the uh, developer team saw what we were saying. So as you guys see, pretty much they copied the same exact card art and all they did was get rid of that little line right there. Here, there's the lines right here, and just make it a half card or something. Like, I don't even know what this little thing is. But people were not happy about it. They felt it was lazy. They felt that... Because ever since, like, Madden 13, when things first started, card art was always great. It was getting better. And then, like, you get to Madden 25, Madden 15. Card art was getting, like, super, super cool. Even if I didn't play too much back then. Like, I played. Well, even if I didn't appreciate it, I should say, as much as I, I realize now. Card art was super cool. Halloween card art. This cool Marshall Lynch's, Takeo Spikes, all those cards. Uh, my master Odell, and then it seems like after like 16 17 it slowly starts to come back down and i don't know why i took that route i guess i got lazier the ones pay the graphics less they cut costs where they could i really don't know the exact legalities of everything but that is what it appears like on the surface now moving on from fixed madden for uh card art he did make a tweet that does reference that they are working on it or they did work on it in some aspect now i'll go to that tweet real quick so we can read over that okay so as you guys do see here it says the community didn't sonic the hedgehog us but there is a new layout of the item that lives in combination with the 50-50 view we've all seen. Tune in Tuesday to catch a look and hear me ramble. I like pepperoni. So, you guys know Sonic the Hedgehog. You guys should know who Sonic is. But there was a movie about Sonic the Hedgehog, a real-life movie type of thing, not too long ago. Now, if you guys don't remember what happened, when that movie was first being produced, and it was, like, I guess halfway through the production, they tweeted out slash released leaks, or they just did it, pictures of graphics of what they made Sonic the Hedgehog look like. Most people figured he looked disgusting. They did not like it at all. They thought it was horrible. They said they weren't going to watch a movie with a, like that bad of graphics. So the the overall consensus was so overwhelming that they actually, I believe, scrapped the movie date, pushed it back, and they reworked the entire Sonic the Hedgehog graphic. I don't know if they had to change scenes or if how they had that done, but they had to rework just about everything. So when you look at it from that perspective. When they say the community didn't Sonic the Hedgehog us, that means that what he's pretty much saying is we didn't force them to re redo all the graphics and re-override re re the game, but they did do a new layout of the item that lives in combination with the 50-50 view we've all seen. So what that could mean is, in terms of card slash mode master, is that that's going to pretty much be, well, what I think, this is my opinion, I could be wrong. If you guys didn't know, in Madden 20, you were able to change card art, like, you had Randy Moss base card art, Randy Moss at least card art, Randy Moss power up card art. You had Randy Moss NFL 100 card art. So maybe what that could mean is that they changed a lot of the items and they've added some more card arts to start the year this time. Because um, that the view we've all seen, so that's something we've seen already. So that could be exactly what they're talking about. As well as a new, there's a new layout of the item. So I don't know how that's going to take effect or 
if there's going to be multiple mutt masks, if that's what he's referring to. But there could be many, many things regarding this. And then the I like pepperoni aspect. Do you, if you guys understand that hint, please let me know down below. It might be a hint. That might just be him saying something stupid. I really don't know. But if you guys know something there. And then tune in Tuesday to catch a look and hear me ramble. So Tuesday is going to be the official Mutt 21 reveal stream. That's where we're going to find out everything. We're going to find out about solo challenges, uh, the level up grind, Mutt Master, level up master, card art, what the binder looks like, what the home screen looks like, um, how the game works, the free Lamar Elite maybe. We're going to find out a lot. That's pretty much going to be most of it, maybe weekend league rewards or seasons rewards. I don't know if they'll give away everything, but we're going to find out a good amount of that stuff, which is super cool. I mean, again, I wish we had gotten this like at least two weeks ago into August versus extended. We've, we've literally, it's been over it's been like 380 days since the last Madden. Getting kind of ridiculous here, or at least 370 something. We should have gotten something right at this point, but moving on from this one, guys, if you want to know what this was in reference to, right about here, um, he said, what a badass accomplishment. Congrats, Alex. Gave us some consideration of making, gave some consideration of making Alex Smith the Mud Master, but ultimately we went another direction. Excited to share more Mud details Tuesday. So if you guys don't already know, Alex Smith had the horrific injury like two years ago where he almost lost his leg. And EA likes to do tribute cards in terms of Mutt Masters. As you guys know, we had Pat Tillman, which was a tribute. Then we had Ryan Chazier twice, which was a tribute. We even had a Sean Taylor at one point, which I believe is a tribute as well. So we always had tributes in terms of that. So I did have, to have that feeling when I did my predictions we might have a tribute. But again, I see the, the difficulty with Alex Smith is his position. He is a quarterback, which would prove to be pretty difficult in terms of giving people that people wouldn't like it. They might like Alex Smith and they'd appreciate it, but they wouldn't really like it. And that's because he's a quarterback and Mutt Master. Typically, you want your Mutt Master to be in a position you can use all year, such as a Tory Holt, such as a Pat Tillman. Now, when it's your quarterback, quarterback is probably the most fun position to buy or the most changed position for some people, depending on how you play. And you get a free Lamar this year, so it would have been really horrible to have had like multiple like free quarterbacks and maybe not even using either one of them. Now, again, it would have been super cool. I wish Alex Smith would have had that chance, but I see where they're coming from. And, again, it's because he was just clear for football activities, so that is kind of where these tweets came from. And, in my opinion, my master probably should never be a, like a, should never really be a quarterback again. It should probably be, like, a, uh, maybe a halfback, if anything. Like, worst case, like, the worst one position I would want is a halfback. And then we got, I think, cornerback, safeties, maybe a linebacker, maybe defensive lineman. That's pretty much about it on that for guys. Pretty much wraps up the entirety of this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you're new to the channel, make sure to go below. Hit that subscribe button. Turn that notification bell. Welcome to the family. Give this video a big thumbs up as always. Helps a lot, guys. We're getting close to the season. Help the channel start booming again. Every like you guys drop really helps the channel out again because we've been been in the dead period of mad. So smash the like button and start subscribing now. Come join. We're going to have great content when the year starts, I promise. But that's about it, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. Hope you guys enjoyed. And be back on Tuesday or tomorrow, depending. But be back on Tuesday specifically for the Mutt 21 news. I'm super excited, guys. I'm out. Peace.